Hey guys, how you going? My name is Dom and welcome to your second video tutorial on Skeleton. Um, so today I want to talk about the 12 column grid system and it allows you to define your own custom web page layouts based on rows and columns. So it works very similar to other front end frameworks such as Bootstrap. And the basis is you have 12 columns to work with to define your own section. So for example, if you want to have um, two evenly spaced halves on your web page or two even columns on your web page, um, you would assign the value of six columns to both sides. That way you get six plus six equals 12 and you have two evenly spaced columns. Okay, so um, let's see an example of that inside this HTML file right here. Okay, so um, we can see here I've got skeleton included on top here. Okay, and in the body, we're going to begin with the container. So the container contains your rows and the rows then contain each one of your columns. Okay, or each one of your individual sections. All right, so let's go ahead here and make a new div with a class of container and put some text inside here. So I can save this and refresh my browser and we get this right here. We get decode and it's centered inside a div. Okay, it's also responsive. All right, so now let's put a row inside the container. So it's a div with a class of row. Decode can go inside here now. I can save and refresh and we get the same result. So we can see here that the row is going to contain or it's going to take up the same width as its container. All right, let's keep that in mind. So now we're going to define both of our two sections. So as I said, these will, um, these will be the same width. They're going to be two even sections. So um, we're going to define two divs inside here. So we've got a div here, the class of six space columns. So this is the way um, you define your columns using skeleton. You say your number, for example, six with a space and then columns. If you want one column, you would simply just say one and then say column. So um, definitely quite readable here by skeleton. All right. So we have six columns right there. This means it's going to create a, um, a section that is half of the row or half of the container because half of 12 is six. So decode goes inside here now. I can save this and refresh and we get the same result. But this time in the inspector, we can see that this column takes up half the space as the row, which means if I was to add some background color to the actual row, for example, style background as being red. Okay. And same goes for the actual uh, section here. We'll say background as being blue. I can save this and refresh and we get this. So the rows in red, okay, and the columns in blue. So we can see how it works, okay. We can now define our second column. We can just copy all this, and now we're going to put the background as being green. So we have our two six-column sections here, um, which equal to twelve. So I can save this and refresh, and now we get this. So we get both uh, both sections or both main columns with some space in the middle. Okay, so that is the basis of how um, the 12 column layout works. So if you wanted to define, um, let's just say three sections or three columns instead of two, you would simply just say four plus four plus four equals 12. So back inside here, um, let's just replace these two sixes with four. Okay. I can save this and refresh and now we get this right here. We get one third, one third and one missing third. So we have here four plus four is eight. We have four columns left. So now I can just copy this one and make one more and we can say uh, yellow, for example. I can save this and refresh and we get here our final result. Okay, so you can see how it's working. And if you was to go on mobile here, it just collapses. Okay, so um, definitely, definitely very easy to work with. Um, now, if you want to have uh, two columns, sorry, uh, two rows, it's um, equally as simple. So um, we'll just make our second row below here, 
So we'll say a class of row, and we're still inside the container. Okay, so same container. Um, so now inside here, let's just make, for example, uh, uh, let's just say eight and four. So eight and four, two columns. So we'll say uh, div with a class of eight columns. And we can just put some text in here, such as, uh, let's just say, decode JavaScript tutorials. I don't know. Okay, and we can copy this and we'll say for this time. We'll say here, CSS tutorials. I can save this and refresh. And now we get this right here. So we can see that our eight is like that and our four is like that. So um, I'll just change this to, let's just say, five and seven for more of a... Um, more of an effect. So we'll say 5 and 7, okay? Once again, equaling to 12. Refresh this, and now we see we get um, this right here. Okay, so that right there is the 12 column grid system in Skeleton. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.